Now, dito na tayo sa number 7 sa ating ratio and proportion na problem. At ito ay nakapost sa ating FB group na Philippine Civil Service Review for All. Let's read the problem. The number of oranges in three baskets are in the ratio of 3 is to 4 is to 5. So, bali ito yung first basket. Ito yung second. Wait. So, ito yung second at ito naman yung nasa third basket. So, ang ratio nila ay 3 is to 4 is to 5. Now, let's proceed. In which ratio the number of oranges in the first two baskets? Ito yung first two basket, yung first and second. Must be increased so that the new ratio becomes 5 is to 4 is to 3. Magiging 5, yung first basket, yung second basket daw ay magiging 4 is to 3. Naintindihan nyo ba yung given? Ang given dito. Yung nasa first statement, yung three baskets na yan, ito yon yan yung ratio nila. Three is to four is to five. Now, sa next dito, yung ratio naman, the number of oranges, sa mismong first and second basket, yan lang yung in-increase. Therefore, yung third basket, yan yung pariho lang yung number of oranges. So, ang in-increase lang dyan, or yung napunuan lang ng mga oranges ay yung basket number 1 at basket number 2. So, ang next natin gagawin, dito tayo sa same lang yung number of oranges, hindi in-increase. Dito tayo sa third basket. Yung third basket na yan, yan yung i-multiply natin. 5 times 3 and that is 15. Yung 5 na yan, yan yung pang-multiply natin dito and this is 20. Next, yung 5 na yan, yan yung pang-multiply natin dito and this is 25. So, 25 is to 20 is to 15. Now, remember, itong ratio sa first set, so let A para sa first set ng ratio, so itong 5A na to, yan din yan, yung 5 na yan, yan ay equal dito sa 3, let B para naman sa second set sa ratio, yan yan siya, so equal yan siya. So ngayon ang next natin gagawin itong 3 na ito, i-multiply natin dito, and this is 15. Next, yan ay i-multiply natin dito sa 4, and this is 12. At yung 3 na yan, i-multiply natin dito sa isang 3 sa first basket. So, 3 times 3 and that is 9. Now, kunin lang natin yung difference dito. So, since same lang naman dito, so walang tayong, dif wala tayong difference. 0 yan siya, yung nasa third basket. Sa second basket, 20 minus 12 and this is 8. Sa first basket, 25 minus 9 and this is 8. 16. Now, itong 16 is to 8. I must simplify natin yan by finding the greatest common factor, which is 8. So, 16 divided by 8, and this is 2. 8 divided by 8, and this is 1. So, ito na yung bagong ratio dito sa first basket at yung second basket. At yan ay nasa letter D. Thank you for watching and all I hope mayroon kayong naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.